Burning in Lake County started yesterday afternoon, quickly destroyed dozens of mobile homes in the Clear Lake area. And that's where we find KTBU's Alyssa Harrington. You're out there right now. You've been out there for quite a while, Alyssa. So what's the latest? What are you finding out? Well, Dave, as the sun's coming up, you really get a better look at yeah. the damage. Now, I'm here at the Cash Creek Mobile Home Estates. I'm going to show you what we're looking at. Block after block looks just like this. We are seeing dozens of homes destroyed. Um, behind me, you can actually see that the ground is pink, a shade of pink. That is because that's where fire retardant was dropped yesterday when they were doing that aggressive air attack. Now, another thing I want to show you is over there, you see uh, a fire truck. We just saw firefighters pull their hoses out. They're spraying hot spots this morning, so still a lot happening here at the scene. Uh, it's hard to count just how many homes were destroyed, but pretty much this entire block gone. Uh, now, neighbors say that yesterday they knew that this fire was getting close because they could hear it. Listen to this. All you heard was explosion after explosion because they're all on propane tanks. The cash fire forced thousands of people in Lake County to evacuate. Some only had minutes to grab their belongings. In fact, one resident here at the mobile home park had to be forcibly removed because he refused to leave his home, even as flames were inching closer. Firefighters say they also encountered some scary moments when fire jumped the road, trapping first responders. The mobile home right next door to that person was on fire, was actively burning, and the person didn't want to go. We had to take that person out. First responders that were stuck behind the fire lines that couldn't get out, luckily they made it safely, but there was a time where it was really touch and go. All right, so we're showing you live again some of the damage here at the Cash Creek Mobile Home Estates. That's off of Dam Road here in Clear Lake. Uh, we're seeing bed frames, pieces of furniture. Uh, there were a lot of down wires this morning, a tree that was split in half. Uh, so there's a lot of hazards in the area. Of course, uh, police do have this area blocked off, so residents are not able to come back at this time to see what's left of their homes. We've also seen a lot of burned out cars. I mean, people really only had minutes to get out of here. At least one person was hurt. Firefighters say, though, that because of the red flag conditions yesterday, they were prepared. They had their engines um, positioned in certain spots. They were fully staffed. So when this fire broke out, they were able to respond. They say that they have slowed forward um, uh, movement or forward progress. Uh, and at this time, it is 20% contained. Reporting live in Clear Lake, I'm Alyssa Harrington, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Alyssa.